But you guys, I did. We're currently waiting in the Toyota dealership because I'm going to test drive a Toyota RAV4 because I'm getting a new car. <laughs> Hey friends, welcome to the video. Today is a really exciting day because I'm probably going to be buying a car today. I've been waiting for this time for a really long time because I finally do need a car because the ones that my family currently has are literally from 2000. Pretty much the newest car I've ever driven is from 2000, which is like older than me. I am buying this car with the money I saved up from work and doing social media content creation. So it's definitely a really big purchase, but I'm really excited. I did go to a dealer with my parents two weeks ago, but the price was a little bit too marked up for what it was. So we're going to another dealer today and hopefully they have um, the same car that we want that's in like a more reasonable price range without all of the dealership add-ons. I am looking to get a white RAV4 from Toyota. So that's the car that we're most likely getting. All right, let's go. So we just went into the dealer and they sold out the car that I wanted, which was the white one. And they said they won't have it until a month later. So we're gonna try to see if we go to a different dealership if they have the same car that I want. <laughs> Guys, I just signed the deposit for the car. It was a slightly different model and make than the one that I originally wanted, but overall, very happy with it. But the only thing is, it's gonna take around two months for it to come, so yeah, you guys will see the car soon. New update, super exciting. The car has finally arrived today. Um, it is May 25th and I'm super excited. It was a really long journey, we waited around two months to go pick it up, so come pick it up with me. <laughs> Guys, we got the car. The first look. All right guys, I was literally at the dealership for four hours doing paperwork, but I finally got the car. She's so pretty. This is how it looks from the outside. It's a 2023 RAV4 XLE Premium. All right guys, I'm gonna give you a little tour in the car. I literally waited in the dealer for four hours because we were doing so much paperwork. I didn't realize how much work got put into buying a car, but finally did it. It is my first big girl purchase with the money that I saved up from working and from social media. So it's a lot of money being sucked out in one go, but you guys, I did it. I've been driving my family's 2000 Toyota Sienna ever since I got my license. So this is a huge upgrade for me and my parents will also be using this car. So I'm super proud of how far things have come. All right, here is a mini tour of the car. So this is the front. There are so many buttons. I still have to read the manual and like figure out how everything works because I just got a few hours ago, but there are more controls here. Um, ooh, the nice thing, I'm trying to open, Let me open this. Okay, so I got it to open, and there are two charging cables here. Here is the back. Here's my camera and back. Ooh, and one thing I love about this car is that all the seats are leather. So I got the premium one, which has other different features. There's even like heated steering wheel, which I didn't know was really a thing. Yeah, leather seats. It's nice. This is how it looks like opened up, and... I am not used to this, but it even has a push button. Whee! 
Oh, also guys, it even has a sunroof, which I've never had in a car before, so I'm super excited for So, I learned a lot through this car buying process, and I'll tell you guys about what I learned in case any of you guys are curious in buying a car or just wanting to see what it's like. I think the first thing to make sure to do is to do your research on what car you want, so the brand of the car and the model. So for me, I went with the Toyota RAV4. I chose Toyota because my family has been driving Toyota vehicles since a really long time and they just are really durable and they last a really long time and the RAV4 is like a really hot model these days it's also really reliable in SUV so I wanted that one for sure I did consider um, other ones and other brands but I just like the reliability of Toyota personally and in terms of actually buying the car I went to several dealerships to find like the different price points and things like that and I realized that some dealerships do markups while others don't so for the one that I went to luckily it didn't have any markups at all so it's just MSRP plus some of the add-ons that they install in the car but with some of the other dealerships we went to they had markups for like two or three thousand dollars just by them selling the cars so I would do a lot of research on that one thing that we also learned is that some programs like for example costco they have partnerships with dealers like toyota and certain models of the car and through that you can get discounts on your purchase so that was also really helpful in um, our like decision process um, and also toyota for me they had a or i guess for all college graduates they have this discount program so if you're two years out of college you can get 500 five hundred dollars off so that was a pretty cool perk um it was not much of discount compared to the entire price of the car but i mean it was still something so yeah hopefully this was helpful and thank you to you guys for supporting me watching my videos and just being with me on this journey i am so grateful for each and one of you who watches my videos and supports so thank you so much hopefully this gave a insight into what it's like to buy a car and this milestone as someone buying a car for their very first time. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe for more content and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.